in today's changing landscape, we have to be ultra vigilant that our schools and general institutions aren't attempting to indoctrinate our youth into troublesome ideologies pertaining to sex, gender, and marginalized communities with evil books, such as the Bible. Here are some other problematic books we should not allow our children to consume. Little Woman, a classic story that implies that women are little or that they exist in any way. If you ask me, it should be called Standardized Menstruating Persons. Moby Dick, a man's obsession with a whale is depicted as negative. <sighs> you do you, Captain Ahab. It's almost as offensive as Queequag not coming out of the closet. His name is so close to queer, but they never outright say it. This one is particularly offensive. Human Reproductive Biology, fourth edition. Can you believe it took four editions and they still didn't filter out the hate? Oh my gosh, ugh. A Little Princess, a similar problem to Little Woman, only now it perpetuates white privilege. Disgusting, ugh. The Berenstain Bears, he bear, she bear. I shouldn't have to explain this one. Take your oppressive gender binary somewhere else, Berenstain Bears. How to avoid huge ships. Fat phobic against beautiful, brave, and majestic huge ships. Ugh. I can't even believe this one exists. Identifying wood by R. Bruce Hoadley. Wood must self-identify. You can't just assume these things. Are you a xylotomist? War and peace. Written by, get this, a Russian. And to top it off, Tolstoy has yet to condemn the actions of Vladimir Putin. Hashtag I stand with Ukraine. That's the first draft of our ongoing list, but this is just the tip of the iceberg. Leave a comment down below with any other books you think should be thrown onto the burn pile. I'm gonna go burn some Tuttle Twin books. Did you just watch a video from the Babylon Bee? Then you are part of the problem. I'll bet you're gonna like, comment, subscribe, and hit that little bell button too, aren't you? You are a cisgendered, heteronormative aggressor. You are perpetuating problematic, toxic ideas of Anglo-normativity. <laughs>